Today we're going to be talking about window treatments and make sure you stay until the end. We're talking about one element in window treatments that nobody is talking about. One of the biggest mistakes when choosing window treatments is you're focusing on the aesthetic first over the function. So here are some things to keep in mind. What are your functional needs for this window treatment? Are you looking for fade prevention, privacy, or blackout? And then aesthetic appeal. Drapery and shades can really add to a space and really complete the look of the room. So there are a lot of options for window treatments, but the two that we're focusing on today is drapery and shades. When it comes to shades, there are many different options, so it just depends on the type of room that you're adding the shade to. You might want a room darkening or complete blackout. One question that we hear a lot is, what's the difference between room darkening and blackout? And something that you should understand is those are two different types of shades. With blackout, that means the room is completely completely black. There is not one piece of light shining through. Room darkening means that the room will be pretty dark, but you will still have a little bit of glow coming through the shade. Some rooms that you would like complete blackout would be your bedrooms. And room darkening would be for rooms such as family room, living room, or if you're a person that you don't like the room completely black when you're sleeping, then a room darkening shade would be perfect for your bedroom. And when it comes to your bathroom, you just want to consider the durability and the moisture that bathrooms can have. So we typically recommend a vinyl roller shade or a wood shade. The best options for kitchens are woven wood shades or a light sheer roller shade. So let's talk about the drapes. So the three types of drapes to consider are fully functioning, stationary panels, and shears. Fully functioning draperies are great for bedrooms because we can line them with the blackout liner and you can have complete blackout in your bedroom. Also, if you live in a high traffic area, draperies can reduce noise in your room. These are great for sound absorption. Stationary panels are great because we like to pair them with shades and the stationary panel just adds a little bit of softness without the heavy feeling and additional fabric of the fully functioning drape. One tip when you're hanging your draperies is you wanna make sure that they're hung higher than your window casing. That'll make the room feel longer and more grand. The last one is shears. Shears are great for spaces that you might want a little bit of privacy, but still let the light in. And these are usually fully functioning draperies. So when it comes to buying shades for your home, you have a few options. You can go to a shade store. So when you go to a shade store, they're solely focused on shades. They most of the time don't offer draperies um, and you're only tied to their types of shades that they sell there. So when you DIY the shades yourself, you're in charge of the measurements, placing the orders, and also the installation of the shade. So where this can go wrong is you can mismeasure, the item might not show up the way that you had ordered it, and also your installer might not be fully qualified to do this. And the last one is to hire an interior designer that specializes in shades and window treatments. When you're working with a designer on your window treatments, they're going to think about the overall aesthetic of the room and suggest the shades that not only look great and enhance your space, but also have the functionality aspect that you're looking for. So the value of working with a designer is that we do both drapes and shades. Also, we help with the back-end facilitation with the measure and the installation. When it comes to shades, we're exclusive to Hunter Douglas. And the reason for that is they offer their installation services with their trained professionals, and you also get the warranty from Hunter Douglas. Our three favorites are Pirouette, Province, and Roller Shades. We like working with these three shades because they offer the texture, the style, and the functionality. So if you wanna check out any of the Hunter Douglas shades, schedule an appointment and visit us in our showroom. So we've saved the best for last. One of my favorite features is motorization. And this is definitely something you should consider for your home. So what motorization is, is that means you can control your drapery and your shades 
all from a remote control or from an app on your phone. So the added benefits is that you can add scheduling and also room scenes. So imagine you have your window treatment set to sunrise and sunset. So you're laying in bed, when sunrise, your window treatments will go up automatically. You won't have to push a button. And then towards the end of the day at sunset, your window treatments then will go down automatically all without ever having you to push a button to open and close them. We add this to about 95% of our projects. Some places to consider motorization is if you have really tall ceilings so that you can easily open and close your shades with a push of a button, or if you travel a lot or you're seasonal, you might wanna have your shades set to a certain time and day where they open and close. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you have questions on window treatments, be sure to leave them in the comments below. And if you're looking to add window treatments to your home, give us a call or visit us in our studio. If you're looking for more design inspo, be sure to check out this video next. Cool. <laughs>